Hello everybody, I'm Bishop Columba and it's my privilege at the moment to be the Chair of the Bishop's Commission for Relations with Aboriginal and Torres Strait Islander Peoples. So it's really, really exciting to give you this little message as we prepare to have our Aboriginal and Torres Strait Islanders Sunday Mass live streamed. How excellent is that? Especially after we've had the restrictions of COVID-19 which has all put us under a bit of a cloud. We have serious problems in our societies of discrimination. When it's important to realise that true reconciliation for us Catholics comes with being drawn together in the one spirit, as one. We as Catholics, we're celebrating this, the, the important role, the crucial role that our Aboriginal and Torres Strait Islander people have in our church. Your faith, your patience under great difficulties should inspire all of us. It's so powerful. The Aboriginal spirituality of Aboriginal and Torres Strait Islander people have been able to be in tune and listen to the divine listen to the Holy Spirit, talking to him, to have ears for those things that we cannot see or hear in this world. It's so important that you are open to a realm of existence outside the mundane, the physical, which we need to rediscover in the Catholic Church. You are so, so important and I wish you all the best as we celebrate our special Mass today. Jesus acknowledges the pain and hurt of people. In the reading of today's Mass, the Gospel reading, he says, come to me all you who are labour and are overburdened and I will give you rest. Shoulder your yoke and learn from me for I am gentle and humble in heart. And I'll give you rest. I'll give your souls peace. Isn't that what we need? We need our Lord to take that pain, that suffering from us, that bitterness, to give us that peace. And this is the peace that we all need. And we ask the Holy Spirit always to bring us together with that peace. As no matter what colour you are, what race you are, we're all one in Christ. We're all made in the image and likeness of God. And that respect and appreciation for God's beautiful creation and us as a part of that creation is the true foundation for us as Christians and Catholics for um, reconciliation in our world. God bless you. We are all one together in the spirit.